Hey YouTube, how are you all doing? Back today with another guitar video, obviously not a tutorial. Um, it's actually showing you my new guitar I've just got. Um, it's a beautiful guitar I bagged this morning. Um, I traded on my Ibanez EX. we done one tutorial with that. Um, but yeah, so it was just a trade on that. I've got to show you. So I got a uh, nice hard case with it. It's very nice. Maybe about £50 new. So here it is, it's a Schecter. Um, I'm a big fan of Schecter. It's a Diamond Classic, Diamond Series Classic. Um, so it's quite an old guitar. So it's six string, um, jumbo neck, 24 frets. Um, not too sure on the pickups. They're probably just Schecter custom, um, Schecter's own pickups. Could do with a bit of a clean, but for the price of, uh, it is a 900 quid new. So for the price of, uh, I need something out in there. Um, the Ibanez I got for trading my Blackstar amp. I'm not, I'm not really bothered about that. So yeah, it's 24 frets, the fret inlay. It's just like one continuous strand, if you will. It's got the classic on the 12th fret, which is a nice touch there. It's just Mother of Pearl. Um, got the nice cream binding around, around the, uh, the body of the guitar. Got nice knobs. Uh, actually see the mechanism work. That's a pretty cool touch. Uh, three way toggle switch, like I said, I need something else a bit loose. Um, yeah, it's a very nice guitar. It's like a uh, Dragon Blood Red, I think is what you call this Dragon Blood Red. That's pretty cool. Um, flip it over. It's a string through body as well. Uh, if you don't know why, it's where you basically just put your strings through the wood and it comes out there. My Jackson also has that feature. So it's not like a Floyd Rose or anything, which I'm so glad about because I want to move away from those. Um, obviously you've got the toggle switch going on in there. Uh, neck through construction. These are brilliant. These hold the tuning really well. Um, the more sustained, if you will. Um, slight ding there. I'm not really too bothered for 900 quid. Uh, well, for free, if you will. That's actually tight. That's... Uh, Love the red, the like maroon and gold. I think it's brilliant. Up here, there's the serial number for it: oh five eleven six six five. I've got Grover tuners now. My Sinister Gates guitar. My other Shecter has Grover tuners on it. I don't know if you can make that out there. There we go. Um, you know it's same. Same on this guitar as it is with the other Shecter. So that's two Shecters I've got now. In the space of five months, I'm doing well. Slowly moving up in the world of the guitars. Um, needs some new strings on it, so I'm gonna have to go into town and buy some new strings. And um, yeah, the case is nice. It's a nice red, well, purple velvet. It's got the guitar look really nice with the uh, red and gold finish and the black. I think it's a uh, ebony fretboard that as well, which is a really nice touch. Uh, makes it stand out. It is. It is such a beautiful guitar. Um, surprised. I'm surprised the trade actually went. I'm on a page on Facebook, basically just like uh, music gear for sale and trade in the northwest, where I'm based. I saw this beauty. Uh, it was listed at one thousand pounds. I thought, all right, that's just going to be a random number he's put in. Uh, he said, uh, I will trade for the right guitar. So I put up a picture of the EX series that I just got rid of for it and. That was the right guitar, so that one I'm impressed with. It. This was at like half ten in the morning, so that's all I've been thinking about when I've been at work. I'm not. Uh, uh, really iconic head. Um, like the, uh, just like the shape they've got on all the. Uh, it's like it's a C1, so all the C1 series have that C1 diamond, diamond C1. Um, I was really impressed with this I need to try it through the amp first, so let's go see how that goes. Okay, so I'm not just going to play it through the amp on this video, I'll do that in a different video, it's just that I need to sort a bit of the soldering out in the uh, the input, which is a shame, but it's an easy job to do. Um, if not, I'll just get this one to do it before I'm professional, so I'm not playing around with it. I might even look into buying some AMGs for those pickups, um, or like knuckle busters, things like that. And um, give it a really nice crisp tone. Don't get me wrong, those. I literally, I've just played it through the amp. Um, it does sound nice, but it's a really wide neck as well. I'm not used to them being that wide. Um, but 
nevertheless it's a great guitar um so yeah guys if you're looking for your favorite guitar brand i'd recommend trying a schecter obviously i tried my sense to get one and it just plays beautifully so schecter has got to be my favorite at the minute favorite guitar it was bc rich but then he had that monkey bird pro x and i kind of went off bc rich from there um it was Ibanez, but then again, check to just take the biscuit. So thanks for watching this quick, uh, this quick video, guys. This little like kind of review, or uh, I don't even know specification, I guess, of the uh, Schecter Diamond series, the uh, classic, the one I just got. Um, go check out my other tutorials. Got quite a few up here. Some are pretty good. Some are pretty crap. You'll have to decide. Beautiful. Um. Yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later.